please tell us uh, how do you feel about meeting 10,000 people from around uh, 110 different countries here? Well, my experience at Webit has been phenomenal. The digital revolution clearly is migrating east, and it was a real honor to be here in the center of uh, this really exciting disruption taking place and the diversity of the participants, uh, the quality of the topics, um, the pulse of the entire atmosphere has been absolutely great. It's a, it reminds me of why I love digital so much. Um, and as head of uh, digital globally at Nestle, it's been a great learning experience. Uh, what would you recommend for the I think what's most important for a conference like Webit is just to keep the conversation going, ensure that there's a really good match between you know, the offline, the analog, and the digital. Um, I didn't see as much socialized conversation around the, uh, the speaker topics. I think it could be improved even more. I think there's ways of uh, conferencing in other uh, geographies as well. But overall, I think the conference is clearly working. You're bringing in a great um, audience. And again, the topics are first rate. So I wouldn't change too much, but it's always helpful to drive more conversation and social media on top of the physical event. What would you expect to see at Vivid next year? Well, I would in terms of what I would expect next year, I would certainly expect to see myself coming back, whether speaking or just participating. There's a lot of learning here. Uh, and what's also great about this conference is that it's close to my, uh, my, my, my colleagues in Turkey down the road um, from Nestle, and I've had an absolutely amazing time with them. So I would actually hope to bring more of them here uh, to participate and interact with the various vendors, suppliers, agencies, and other brands.